All right, guys. Finally, another mash. See how this goes. Super Turbo. I haven't played with Ken at all tonight. Maybe I'll play Ken. Ken versus Ryu, huh? Okay. England. Couldn't show you can. Even said reversal, but no show you can came out. Yeah, it sucks because there's stutters. It keeps frame dropping on stuttering, and when it drops my move, I can't do anything. That was for you can, not for Hadouken. Didn't do that. What the hell? I can't block at all. It won't block. Are you kidding me? I give up. I totally give up. Four hits in a row, I was holding back and the game didn't block. So I'm just gonna leave this lobby. There was no reason to play that guy. Four times in a row, it doesn't block. I could see once, maybe twice. Four attempts in a row, it doesn't block. That's when I just tap out. I'm done. That was ludicrously bad. Absolutely terrible. And he wasn't just doing basic jump in attack. You tell me why it didn't block. I wasn't trying to do reversal or nothing. I would admit if I... Okay, I was trying to do reversal to show you again. And my move didn't come out or something. I was literally holding back. And that shit hit me four times in a row. Yikes. See you later, Derek. You have a good night, man. Yeah, I don't know if we'll hit the tips goal tonight or not, but we'll see. Thanks for hanging out with me all day today, man. RPG fan choose. Do you think that's worse or better than Jose's internet? I don't know because I never played Jose. I couldn't tell you, you know, if that's worse or better. The problem with Jose is he goes away to glitch the game. Golden Noble says on chill streams I should throw like a couple of brewskis. Nah, I don't drink that often anymore. Like I said, maybe every once in a while at night I'll have like a, a drink with my wife. Just to unwind after a day of work or something. But I'm not going to drink on the streams, man. Oh my god! Oh my, what is happening? The match was fine, now look at it. Jesus, man. Oi, oi, oi. The jump around still got, got beaten. Wow. Wow. <laughs> that was really bad. Alpha 3 it is. Armika. I don't know how Armika plays. She has some pretty good juggles. I know that. Didn't jump. Alpha counter. I tried to alpha counter the ass, it wouldn't do it. <clears throat> oh, 
Oh, I almost had the combo there. Whoa, that was anti-air didn't come out. What? <sighs> See, this is why I hate this game. Did that guy actually do anything impressive? He didn't even do a single combo. All he did, he knew there was an abusive jumping hitbox with Armika, and he literally just did it the entire round, and I have no answer for it. That's why I hate Alpha 3. Oh, there's an abusive hitbox? Just keep doing it. Over and over and over and over. That's like the game. Because the game is so unbalanced and it doesn't play like real Street Fighter. In a normal Street Fighter game, there'd be a character with a wake-up move. You could blow through that shit. You can't just do it endlessly. But this game fucking sucks so hard that you can just literally do the jumping move over and over and over. And I can't do anything about it. I have no answer for it. And that's why I hate Alpha 3. It's like the game that takes the least fucking skill of any Street Fighter game. It's learn the abusive move, do it ad nauseum, build V is a meter, do the V combo over and over, and then do the abusive move again. That's the whole game. And it, it's just a pattern game that I don't like. So if you saw it crashed, the lobby was not working, so we gotta try to join a different lobby now. Try this. Oh, let's see here. RPG fan chase said Armiga is thicker than a whole bowl of oatmeal. In that game, she that's her first appearance, by the way, is Alpha 3. And yeah, she's a weird art style. She looks nothing like the art style of any of the other characters in the game. She's just really differently drawn. Kanye Glover took me a dollar. Did he say, I'm enjoying your stream. Thanks for the chill fun. All right, Kanye Glover. I appreciate that. Thank you for pushing us to the second half of the tips goal for the night. 51 bucks. Thank you. In fact, one thing I want to check, I don't know, there's something weird going on with my PayPal earlier. It didn't look like it was updating properly. So I just want to double check and see if it actually is updating or what happened here. <clears throat> Let's see here. Seems to be updating now. Okay, I don't know. There was weird stuff going on earlier. Where it looked like the balance wasn't updating, but now it is. Uh, Dollboth Charity says, Would you ever do a DSP tries of horrible sugar free gummy bears? I don't know how sugar free would be. Ugh. I've had sugar free stuff in the past. When I was a kid, uh, my mom basically didn't want my teeth to rot, so she thought getting me sugar free candy was a good alternative. Obviously, no, it's eating less candy, but my mom thought, Oh, sugar free candy. So I tried a, a, a variety of either low sugar or. Um, Low sugar or sugar... I can't ready up. What the hell? They wouldn't let me ready up at all so I could see the match. What the hell? And now we're stuck not watching. This collection is ridiculous. Um, But no, I used to have like sugar-free candies that would have like sugar substitutes and stuff. Some of them actually weren't that bad. But in general, they just didn't taste right. They didn't taste like... It would be like, okay, so, you know, I'm... I'm, uh, I'm, I'm eating the candy, and it kind of tastes almost like the real thing. You know what I'm saying? It kind of tastes almost like the candy that I want, but it's not really, and it's annoying because it's not. See? <laughs> so I don't know if I would do sh Haribo sugar-free gummy bears. Plus, I don't think that would be very exciting anyway. Have you ever been to an actual candy shop? Uh, in my local mall, there is a Lolly and Pops candy shop. It's an actual candy store. They only sell candy. And it's not like one of those kiddie candy stores. You know what I mean? Where the kid, it's kids go in, they fill a bag full of chocolate or runts or something. No. They have, like, everything. They have candy from all over the world. They have gourmet candies. They have, like, sea salt and caramel chocolate-covered gourmet pretzels and stuff like that. It's, like, crazy, the stuff that they have. They actually have, um, what do they call Macaroons. They have handmade macaroons that they sell. They have uh, you know, uh, candies you can get from behind the counter that are more like gourmet, while there's other bulk candies in the back. It's a really nice shop. The problem is, pretty expensive to get to, to go there. I think Kat and I once filled a tin with candy, and that was like two years ago. 
Um, True West, I subscribed to the channel. Thank you, True West, for the sub. And yes, Captain Scott, I see you didn't miss the, the 200 vest celebration. I'm sorry to hear that, but remember, you can always watch it on demand later on YouTube if you would like. It is over there. <clears throat> Golden Nobles Cheers said, DSP tries it weed strain reviews. I don't think I'll be doing anything weed related anytime soon on DSP tries it. I'm sorry. I don't think that's in the cards. This kind of sucks, man. Like, I want to play, but every lobby I go into, we're having issues now. I feel like I've only played not even an hour. It's just like a, a letdown this week. I want to play more. Count just got it's already live. The whole 200 best celebration is live. The the non-DSP tries it stuff is live on DSP Gaming. The two DSP tries it's are live over on the King of Hay Vlogs. Oh my god, I can't ready up. Look, I told you. This whole thing screwed up tonight. I can't ready up at all. Come on. Oh fuck, dude, fuck this. This is ridiculous. This is so ridiculous. I can't play games tonight, man. Ugh. No, Zenny, they're never going to fix these lobbies. The game company that made this hasn't worked on it in like a year and a half. They're not going to do any more updates to this broken piece of shit. Which is, in my opinion, ridiculous because they, they're still selling it. And they actually just had a sale where they acted like this was a big game on sale. You should buy it. Like, dude, it's barely functional. How could they even sell it? Why don't I create a lobby? I could, but it won't matter. It'll still be screwed up. Canon DCW took me $5 and I just got off work and Ghost of Tsushima is finally downloaded. Good. Congrats, dude. I hope you, you enjoy it as much as I'm liking it because I'm really loving the game. I cannot wait to play more tomorrow. <clears throat> Thank you for the $5 tip, by the way. <clears throat> Zenny, I agree, says it's a real shame because doesn't it seem like the multiplayer is still pretty active? I, I would say it is. I'd say people have an active desire to play Old School Street Fighter on a console and they just put no effort into this collection. It was literally smash emulators together and just hope it works. And then later on, if there's a, a thing that doesn't work, patch it quickly. And that was it. They just like forgot about it after a few months of it being out there. <clears throat> hey guys, stop derailing the chat with talk about politics. I'll tell you right now. I'm not going to have people arguing about it and shit. Everyone stop right now. Please stop derailing the stream with that crap, okay? I want to hang out and talk with you guys. I don't want to hear about people talking about all this shit, this political shit. Papa Phil, Big Papa Phil says I actually did play Jose before. Most of the time he would run away and just jump away and mash kicks. You know what it is? Because he basically wanted to troll me. So that's how he trolled me at first until apparently he found a way to completely crash the game every time. Okay, will it work? Okay. Ken Kniff? Alright, I will play with Zangief. Or Zangief. However you want to pronounce the name. Yes. Yes. Yes! Oh! Ultimate destruction. Very nice. Yes! RPG fan cheered. 100 bits. Do you think the one guy who made a glitchy netcode in the early 2000s who asked for criticism and then got mad at you for giving him actual constructive criticism is behind bad netcode of this game? No. You're probably talking about one of the cannons. And the answer is no. They did not make the netcode of this game. This is not GGPO netcode to my, my knowledge. Oh! T-Hawk again. Look who it is. It's Ramza. It's the same guy.
I'll probably regret this because I don't really know this fight very well. Oh, nice. Whoa. What the hell? Oh my god, that looks so weird. No. Oh god. Oh man, that was a close fight. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> So many hitboxes were going like right next to each other. Damn, dude. Ugh. Ugh. Nope. Oh, nice move. Again with this. No, don't do that. Oh my god, good move. No! <laughs> Jab. No, don't do it. Oh, fuck. Good combo. I'm done. That's dizzy. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Walk forward chapter 60 and it got me. Oh man. The end of the second round was crazy. He did walk forward. He walked forward. I jabbed him to stop him and he said, give me your head. That was a cool fight. But again, I don't know the fight. I don't know that fight at all. I suspect that I was gonna lose that one. Uh-oh, did it glitch? I think it did. Uh Timbo Slice Chase, how much longer stream? I wanted to play at least till 9.30. I've barely gotten any matches tonight. Look at this. This keeps happening where it keeps glitching the fuck out, man. This is very frustrating. Seriously. <clears throat> the lobby isn't working, man. Oh my god. It's such a downer. When I have a week like this, I'm trying to play the game, and the game just refuses to cooperate with anybody, right? Like, come on, man. Yikes. Work! Work, you piece of fucking shit. <clears throat> well. It didn't work. It glitched. Don't tell me the game crashed. Seriously, don't tell me the game has crashed. Uh... <laughs> Timbo Trudy said, Is Street Fighter the only game you still get the itch to play after all these years? Pretty much. Like, I would say... <clears throat> I would say... That every once in a while I get an itch to play the classics. Like Super Mario World. Maybe the classic Zelda, like Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. The old Final Fantasies. And I just, I actually just satisfied that itch of the old Final Fantasies recently. The past couple of years, I played those, and I just, I replayed Super Mario World on the uh, Switch recently. Remember, was it last year? So in that regard, I kind of satisfied those desires to play the classics, you know. Um, but outside of that, it really is Street Fighter that I always constantly get the itch to go back and play. I do. It's this, this, these classics are the ones that I want to play the most. <clears throat> All right, let's try this again. Ooh. Um. Why is it? I like apple cider. I do like apple cider. Absolutely.
Oh, he pushed me again. That's <laughs> so weird. There's weird things going on. Weird matchups and weird things happening here tonight. And Jose ruins it all. Great. Jose ruins the whole fucking thing for everyone again. What a fucking surprise. Oh my god. Kanye Glover took me a dollar thirty. says, uh, I wrote you, you're not calling. I left myself my pager and my home phone at the bottom. Well, I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry I'm not calling you back. Thank you for the tip. We're up to $57 tips tonight, guys. So we are making progress. Albeit slow, but we are making progress. Like I said, I played for at least another half hour. I feel like I barely got any matches in tonight because of this fucking crap. <clears throat> Timbal Slice Chew said, That switch I was able to find after looking for five months comes Monday. I purchased Animal Crossing and Luigi's Mansion 3 to start. Two pretty great games. Yeah. I, I, I was shockingly surprised at how good Luigi's Mansion 3 was. I thought it was going to be like not a very good game. It ended up being like super duper fun. So I think you're going to like that one. Animal Crossing, hit or miss. If you're looking for a relaxing game, I think you'll like it. It does take a lot of grinding and time investment in order to kind of get to the point where you can do the fun stuff with the island, like the terraforming. But once you're there, the game opens up and gets a lot better. But please understand that it is not a riveting game with an end or nothing. It's more like, I want to relax and chill. Let me do something with this game. You see what I mean? Versus, oh, it's an active challenging game or whatever. I hope you didn't get the wrong idea. <clears throat> Velik Monroe has resubscribed in nine months. It's happy Friday, buddy. How are things going with your streams? Hopefully back to normal. Can't stop the king of hate. So far, so good. This week, you know, as of <clears throat> my return on Wednesday, we've had now three straight days with no issues, which is great. Um, so that's a positive for sure. And, uh, you know, we're, we're trying to play Street Fighter. Let's put it that way. We're trying. It's not going so well with this collection, but we're trying. Order 66 Survivor says that he might also get a Switch and play Animal Crossing. Um, what I actually announced a while back is that eventually I may, once I start playing Animal Crossing on the regular again, I may have a session where I distinctly choose to visit viewer islands. It just hasn't happened yet because I haven't played Animal Crossing consistently now in a while, so I don't know if and when it would happen. But I would be open to doing that eventually, maybe. Okay. Timbal Slice says, I used to get into Animal Crossing on the DS. Well, then you probably get the gist of what the game is and you know what to expect. You probably won't be disappointed then. <clears throat> Ihana e against Armika. Here we go again with the Armika ass bouncing. <laughs> Whoa, look at that weird juggle. God, this game is fucking odd. This guy does not know what he's doing with Honda. He's just kind of mashing buttons. See, she's got this jumping that's pretty much easy to do and free, and you can't do anything about it. You can't punish it or nothing. Dullbug, I don't know what the stupid romance cat meme is. I have absolutely no idea. An uh... Anonymous to me, dollar thirty says Jose moved into harassment territory and he's ruining it for everyone. I mean, yeah, he does it on purpose every week. He's literally doing it just because he gets attention doing it. No one even knows who he is. No one will ever care about him. But he somehow gets some sick satisfaction out of knowing that there's a streamer out there who he can ruin his online experience. Of. I don't know why he would give a shit besides being a complete loser. But some people are just complete losers. I mean, maybe that's the explanation. That was a level three super to do like almost no damage. Wow. Hmm. Will I still do Street Fighter Fridays after I move over to next gen? Probably. Right now, there's nothing consistently to play on next gen. There's just not. You know? And it's not like I'm going to be unhooking my PS4 and shit when the next gen games come out. So. <clears throat> I'm going to play with Ken. I only played him with it once, and that was the match where he didn't block four straight fucking times in a row. Whoa. That was sure you came. Couldn't block. Whoa. Couldn't block the jumping. 
Couldn't do a Shoryuken. Couldn't get a third move and I, I could throw. I can't block. Can't do anything. Can't do anything. Still can't do anything. The connection is so bad, I can't do reversal Shoryuken. I can't do wake up Shoryuken to stop what he's doing. So he just gets away with walking forward and mashing punch. So what's the point of even playing? He just walks forward and mashes punch and he gets hit throw, hit throw, and the connection is so bad, I can't do a single thing about it. That's pathetic. That's absolutely pathetic. Well, let's see here. Uh, some random black otaku did a 500 bit cheer. Says, "Am I crazy? Or did I match up with you? I don't know who. I don't know who you were. But after that match, there's no way I'm staying in that lobby. The dude walks forward and mashes punch. I can't do anything. Like, okay, that's enough of that. I've just had a really bad experience with this game tonight. Right? It hasn't been good at all. So Shy Labut just tipped forty two dollars, and that means we actually hit the tips goal for tonight." Thank you to Shia LaButt. He says, I'm making this donation on behalf of Mackenzie Beckett. She couldn't be here tonight on the special day. Her favorite number is two, by the way, and she wants you to put on the vest. All right. I have no idea what any of that means. But I do appreciate the, the contribution, Shia LaButt. Thank you very much. That gets us up to the $100 tip skull. Now, that gets us to 202 Vestry. Would you guys like to see the original beige the blue, the platinum, or the new slim gray. Which vest would you guys like to see tonight? <clears throat> Max Caulfield's the slim gray. Uh, blues, platinum, platinum, blue, new slim gray, 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 platinum. It's looking like between platinum and gray at this point. Excuse me, that's disgusting. Okay, let's get the gray. Since it is the new one, I figured it would be the one people probably want to see. <clears throat> okay. All right. The slim gray. <laughs> Uh, Freddie Bicardi uh, also did a 500-bit cheer and says, What happened to the crown emotes? Um, they went away when I got false DMCA claims against me earlier this week. They're coming back supposedly at the latest a week from Monday. I know that sucks because that means, you know, a long-ass time to wait. But apparently that's the legal requirements that Twitch has to follow. Um, but yeah, they are coming back. It just sucks that I can't really do much about it to speed up the process. Okay. So the Slim Gray Vest, thank you very much everyone for the support tonight. Now, will I actually get any fucking matches in? This is terrible that I can't get any matches in tonight. And then when I get a match, it's complete garbage, right? When I get a match, the fucking thing doesn't work right. And someone walks forward and matches punch and I can't even do anything about it. <laughs> so laggy. Oh my god. Polish Frog, I don't think we need to joke about that. He says, oh, 25 minutes to try to get the big reveal by doubling the tip skull. And I, we're not going to double the tip skull tonight. I feel eventually we will because there have been some times when we have just naturally doubled the tip skull or someone comes in is very generous and we do it. Now, at least instead of the silly gunner glasses, we'll have a big build. Oh my God, we finally doubled the tip skull. Now we get to see what the big reveal is. See, it'll be more exciting this way. <clears throat> okay. Are you ready? Not what I did. Oh my god, the lag! I couldn't punish the Shoryuken. I didn't do that. Slapped him in the foot. 
slap your tootsie. Into the heat of battle. Go for it. That was really stupid. That shouldn't have worked. You win. I hate because you're just supposed to do standing medium cancel into the stomps. You do it three times, and then you get a super cancel, and then you can do the Tanku Stone Juggle. But I can almost never get it online because of the lag in this game. What's funny is I used to be able to do that combo all the time in Third Strike Online on the Xbox 360. I can't do it in this collection because this collection is far laggier than that one was. Um, I didn't play with Vigor or Balrog tonight. I don't really think I need to. I'm just saying, like, I don't really think I need to dominate these guys that badly. All right, you know what? I'll pick big against Guile. You walked right into me a million times. I don't know why. Yo, Ligo Leahy. on at least till 9 30 but i'm looking at i i haven't even played for a half hour in this video yet because the connections were so bad and i kept dropping and everything so chances are maybe i'll stay a little later i don't have to end early tonight at all i actually can go a little later so maybe, we'll see how connection if connections are good and i can play people maybe i'll stay a little later we'll see what happens uh eh, play with ken again Super. I can't do super. Got him. No fireball. Oh, he didn't get his either. We both dropped our moves. He can't get his at all either. This game sucks. I, I feel bad because this guy can't get his fucking move either. It's so lame. So stupid. Upscaled man. Resubscribe for three months. And I thank you, upscaled man, for the three month resub. I appreciate that. Seriously, how was that for neither of us to get our moves out? We're both like doing it and just getting nothing. <laughs> or get the wrong move completely. This guy's not even playing. I don't know what's going on with that guy. Oh my god, now this guy's... Uh... Come on! Oh yeah. <laughs> a coomer. The a coomer. Perfect. All right, that's cool. Fighting ready. Engage. Yeah. 
you, that's what I wanted. Easy peasy. Am I gonna play Volcano High School? I have no idea, El Grazoro. RPG fan chased it. That's awesome stuff. I can't wait to see what the reveal is. The Windsor Redemption move in as your roommate. Yes, that's the big reveal if you didn't know. Oh. Never mind. I actually won a match. That was my big mistake. Actually winning a fucking match was the big kiss of death for me, apparently. <clears throat> Dalboth cheered. He said, Frog Frogerson said he had to lie about the red vest to protect his family. Is that true? I don't even know what that means. <laughs> what does that fucking mean? Anyway. We got Honda. Now, I don't know how Honda plays. He's a weirdo character in this game. What the flip? Oh, it didn't come out. Oh, my move didn't come out. Wow. My move didn't come out. are so weird. Nope. Oh my god. It's stuffed. I did the anti air, it stuffed it. Nice. That was actually nice. Whoa. That was the entire didn't come out. Oh my god, it's hitting me. Wow. Oh! No! Oh my god, are you kidding? I won, holy shit. What a fight. Shout out to Upscaled Man who took me $25 and says, been watching the videos for years. I love the old condo tours and Fremer Crush ridicule videos. Fallout 3 was the first gameplay to remember. Don't let the haters and internet trolls get you down, man. All right, thank you very much for that. I appreciate that. That was a nice positive message and obviously support. Thank you. We're now up to $125 of tips. Thank you guys. Not $250 in tips. That's false. $125 in tips. Jeez. We'll do a Ken Mirror match. And both Kens are green. So I'm the one on the left that's more like an aqua green or a seafoam green. Well, he's more of like a, a lime green, I guess I would say. I didn't do that. Oh my god, the lag is so bad. I was sure you can not fucking jab. 
I can't do a move. Every time I go to do a move, there's a lag spike. Oh my god. That was super. I got jabbed. Oh! Elgrey Zoro says he wants a lime green vest. That would be pretty crazy if there was one. I haven't been able to find one like that. Not what I did. That's what, no, that's what I did. That is such a bad match, so laggy. <clears throat> Alright, so not that I, I, I need to say it, but if we do double the tips goal tonight, um, I will be doing a big a reveal that I was supposed to do on the 200 vest celebration earlier today, but we didn't hit the goal. I'm not saying we're going to get $75 more in tips right now. I'm just saying by some freak chance if we do, because I didn't think we were going to hit the tips goal at all, and now we're over the tips goal tonight. So just throwing that out there, but... <clears throat> Yoshi all over. Yes, I also am looking forward to more Ghost of Tsushima tomorrow. A lot. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh. See, when I play him, I try to challenge myself by using characters who I know aren't good against him. Because if I pick a character I'm good with, I'm just going to completely dominate the poor guy. Because Seahawk sucks. Fan cheers says, Do you know of your white? My what? Dude, okay, I have no fucking idea what you're talking about right now. You're talking about wild shit about my wife's family members and Wings of Redemption, neither of which I'm going to address on a fucking Street Fighter stream, so I think you need to chill the fuck out. <laughs> what the fuck? Well, upscaled man tipped another $25, so let's get the tips goal. We're now at $150 in tips. We're actually closer on this stream than I think we were on the earlier stream to hitting the tier 2 tips goal. Whoa. I didn't do that. I did a fucking torpedo. Oh, I fucked up. I should have done it later. Oh, we traded and I got him. A bad trade for him. So we are at $150 in tips, guys. <laughs> if you can believe it. Now Jose is going to fucking kill the lobby for me, of course. So 50 more dollars in tips. And yes, I will do the reveal. This is wild. I don't know if this is going to happen tonight or not. This is pretty crazy. <clears throat> okay. Let's keep trying to play. A doll bot you said... Everyone gets to the compliment right now. I will donate fifty dollars. Look at that. Dalbot will, will donate fifty bucks if everyone compliments me. There's no way that would happen ever in history. <laughs> okay. Sucks. I can't watch this match. Timbo slice cheered. He said, get that red vest ready. It's going on tonight. I don't know, man. I am going to stick around at least for another 15 minutes, if not a little longer. Only because I want to play two hours of matches, and I haven't gotten two hours of matches in yet. It's ridiculous. Yeah, I, I don't know if we're going to hit tier 2 tips goal tonight. Thank you very much, uh, Upscaled Man, though, for the tips. I appreciate that. I do appreciate that support, man.
Polish frog, it's funny you say that. He says, why don't you buy one of those vests that you would wear in a suit? I think I I think I'm I might eventually get one like that. I did see one at like a store that sells stuff that they resell, and it was pretty cheap too. Um it doesn't look great, admittedly, it's a black black color. So I might get one like that eventually. What I wanted is a lighter vest, and I found this one online. I was like, wow, this one's actually quite nice. It's, it's comfy, and it looks nice, and it's thin. So if I got this one first. I may eventually get a thin or, or a dress vest like that for the cheap. We'll see. Or on the cheap, I should say. Nelson has resubscribed or, or has subscribed to the channel. Excuse me, Nelson. Thank you for the subscription. Well, Snakefish Gaming is actually one person who did compliment me. He says, Phil, you're a good man. I'm trying to, to make... He's just a good man trying to make his way, doll, but... So I said it would never happen, and I was right. Only one person complimented me. A single person. That was it. Ladies and gentlemen, Shy LaButt just to be $50. He says, Mackenzie Bucket wants to know what the big reveal is about, dude. All right, guys. Well, Shy LaButt took $50 to see it. All right, then. We've done it. We've doubled the tips call. I have to hurry up because this match is going way too fucking fast with cyber fighting. Hold on. <laughs> it's too fast. All right, hold on. Alright. <laughs> oh, no, hold on. There's not enough time. I'm not even ready. I'm not ready. Can you believe it? Can you believe it, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> like you didn't know what it was. Like you had no clue what it was, right? Yes, the vest exists! The Phantom Red Vest! Alright, hold on, I gotta play a match. Oh shit! Ah! Not do that. I not do that. Still not sure you again. Oh my god, seriously? No sure you can, I had him too. Oh my god. Haha! <laughs> Marty McFly, I don't know. I'll I'll comment on this in a moment. Alright. Can't do a sure you can, it won't do it for me. I can't do a Shoryuken. Every time I try, the game lags up and it drops the input and I get a standing jab. No Shoryuken. What? No super. Oh, I don't have a super. Oh, shit! Ultimate reversal! Ultimate reversal! Okay, well, that was crazy. I wasn't expecting to win that fight. Alright, so I got one more fight. Then I'll update the leaderboards and I'll explain the vest. Because, uh, it looks like Jose's in the lobby is gonna ruin it for us anyway. Okay. Oh my god, really? An Oro Mirror match. Alright, interesting. Oro Mirror match. So I'm the one on the left. I'm the yellow one. He's the orange one. Oh god. Oh no, seriously? He tried to parry it. He tried to parry it. Fighters ready. Engage. 
Oh shit. Oh no, I walked right into it. Oh wow, it stuffed my low kick. I didn't know that. I don't want that. Oh come on. Oh my god, really? It dropped my move. When he landed, I didn't move. Final round. Engage. God damn, I hate that that doesn't track properly. Yeah, see? He moves forward and it whips. I don't like that. Got him. Oh my god, what a fight. That was close. Okay. All right, I got a lot of shoutouts to do here, guys. I can't play Jose. So first of all, let's do the shoutouts, then I'll explain the vest. People are like... No full screen reveal, no proper reveal. It happened in the middle of a fighting game stream. What do you want me to do? I have to play the game, don't I? So hold on and relax. All right. Oh shit, that's not what I wanted. What is this? That is not what I intended to click on. Look at that thing. <laughs> that's from a couple E3s ago, I think. Yeah, that is from a couple E3s ago. Look at that. <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> that was not intentional. Okay, hold on a second. Um, so, here we go. So let's do shout outs and then I'll explain the vest, okay? So, um, Timbo Slice Cheers said, Does it shock you no fighting games have been announced for next gen systems? Uh, not really. Fighting games aren't exactly the rage right now. I'm just saying, Evo got canceled, uh, Smash Brothers community controversy. And quite frankly, we've all wanted Street Fighter 6 info and we get nothing. You know, I don't know, man. I don't think that, that no one's too concerned about fighting games right now. Um, an, an anonymous $2 tipper says, only $48 left, let's do it. Well, that was before someone actually tipped and we actually did hit it. So thank you for that. Um, <clears throat> for the $2 tip, whoever that was. Uh, Dal uh, Dal Both gets it 10 subs. One to Solo M Slayer. One to Halfway to Hell. One to Lamborghini 518. One to Quantrell Bishop. One to Dingle McCheese. One to Time Seer. One to Billy the Farmer. One to Xbox One is Garbage. One to Cadger Brave. And one to Paulie Rath. Congratulations to all of you. All right. Congratulations to all of you guys. Upscale Man tip $5. Let's get to triple the tips goal. No, I'm just kidding. I'm tapped out. Thank you, Upscale Man, for all the tips, man. Really appreciate the support. Um, Shia LaButt to me $2.22. Says, now you look like Barry for Resident Evil. <laughs> Yes, I want to explain. I'm going to explain. Don't worry. And then an anonymous dollar thirty tipper says, "Don't let ungrateful chat ruin your night. Have a good night, man. Thank you, man. I didn't even look at chat. I was playing the game. I couldn't even look. To, I'm sure. Again, just as I described earlier tonight, probably the same ungrateful people from the earlier 200 vest celebration stream also being ungrateful again that we did this. But anyway, so here's the thing. I wanted to get a vest that looked like the Marty McFly vest from Back to the Future. That was my goal actually for this 200 vest streak. Okay, now I've explained to you guys that sadly when you order things online, they don't always turn out how you want. And in the case of the gray vest, that vest turned out perfectly exactly what it looked like. And I wanted that vest for that. And I really liked it. I wanted to get a vest that wasn't red like this, but was actually more orangish red, which is the Marty McFly color. It's a hybrid of like, like orange red. And in fact, when I went to Amazon, to search for this vest, I searched for Marty McFly vest or Back to the Future vest. And this was the one that came up with high ratings. And people were saying it looks like Marty McFly's vest. I'm sorry, in my opinion, it doesn't. Like, the vest type does, but the color is completely off. It's supposed to be more orangish red, right? Not dark red, but this came out as like a dark red color. So it kind of sucks because I was looking for Marty McFly. It doesn't look like that. But people are saying, you look like Barry Burton. I guess so. I, I would say, okay. It's with the headphones, and the, I kind of look like Barry Burton. All right, we'll go with that. It's the Barry Burton vest then. 
Okay. Um. No, see, Polish Fox, is it my camera that makes it look dark red? No, it's 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 pretty dark red. Again, online, they're advertising it as a Marty McFly, looks like Marty McFly vest, and the comments are like, yeah, it's a Marty McFly vest, and I buy it, it doesn't look anything like a Marty McFly vest, it's way too dark, okay? So honestly, I wanted to hype it up as like a Back to the Future thing on the 200 vest stream, I couldn't even do it because it shows up and it's and like, I knew it, it's the second time. That blue vest over there, same deal, I ordered it, it looked lighter, and shows up being really dark, same thing here, it's a dark vest, even though they don't picture it as dark online. So it is what it is, so now I'm Barry Burton at least. That's cool. I guess we could say I'm Barry Burton, so at least it's not Chris's blood, right? Or I hope it's not Chris's blood. Um, it just sucks that I didn't get what I wanted. Maybe eventually I will get a Marty McFly vest, but I can tell you guys this. I already know what kind of vest I want next. It's not a Marty McFly vest, but that's not for now. The next time we'll even have a new vest would be the 250 vest celebration if we do it, if we get to it, okay? All right, I want to play some more. I still don't feel like I got two solid hours in tonight, so I want to play some more. Um, Spartan King Cheese, a lot of people are missing out on the stream. It's been a hilarious and fun one. I'm glad you feel that way, Spartan King. You know, a lot of people don't like tuning into the Street Fighter stuff. And now tomorrow, they're going to be like, what? There was a vest reveal last night? Like, yeah, you guys missed out. You should have been on the Street Fighter stream. You never know what's going to happen, man. Sebastian Photon says, "Will I do I drink wine? Very rarely. Every once in a while, my wife and I will have some wine somewhere. But it doesn't happen very often. <clears throat> What the Why do they both have a Spider-Man avatar? <laughs> the identical Spider-Man avatar. Philly Buck, I said, maybe we can have Marty's vest for 300. Maybe we can. Maybe I can actually find one, because again, this looks like Marty's vest, except the color. It's the actual style and everything. The design looks just like the movie, except the collar isn't right. So... Uh -oh. I don't know. I mean, I'll be honest with you guys. First of all, thank you guys so much. Everyone who just contributed, that's crazy. We, we doubled the goal. That's really generous of you. Thank you for that support. I don't know if we're going to get to 250 because at this point now, we got people who are kind of being a negative influence or kind of souring it, which I hate. I don't want it to be that way. I want it to be a positive, ongoing thing, you know? And I don't want to argue with people all fucking night about it. That's how it is. I feel like I'm arguing with people now about it and stuff. I don't like that. I want it to be a positive thing, a fun thing. So... All right, so let me ask you guys a question. Let me ask you guys a question, all right? <clears throat> Out of all the vests, the beige, the blue, the platinum, the new slim gray, and now the nice, people just call it the dapper red. Out of all those vests, which one do you think is the best vest? What is the best vest on me and the best color vest? <clears throat> See, I think the red is good because the red will go with both light and dark shirts. Like, the red will stand out when I'm wearing a black shirt as well as when I'm wearing a white shirt. <clears throat> platinum red people are arguing between platinum and red they like both someone said classic beige <laughs> platinum and red are top tier I'm being told the red one's nice like this is nice it's very similar to the build I'd say of the uh, beige vest it's not super heavy it actually is a lighter vest it's not as heavy as say the platinum the platinum vest is the heaviest one that one makes me fucking sweat um, <clears throat> Big Huad did a, a dollar thirty tip. He says, "Can't wait for two fifty a new vest, a new fast food, perhaps the spice of life." I mean, that's what we've been going for. That seems to be what we've been going for when we do these uh, celebration events. Is we end up doing a new DSP tries it, and there usually seems to be a new vest that gets uh, you know introduced. So I guess we can go along with that. What we got, Akuma? Timbo Slice, Jason, have a good night. Heading out to play some Ghost of Tsushima. Sounds good, man. Have a good night, uh, Timbo. Into the heat of battle. Go for it. Oh, shit. Oh, what the? Oh, what the hell's going on? He didn't block. I don't know what's happening. I'm hitting him. Okay. Prepare to strike now. Ow! Whoa, that 
that lag spike. I did not enjoy that lag spike that I got right there. You win. An, an, an anonymous tipper tip the dollar thirty says red is the best, followed by blue and boomer beige. <laughs> boomer, boomer beige. I like that boomer beige. We're gonna get a third strike match because I specifically did. <laughs> Okay. Oh man. Time and slaughter, you're in against Electric Slake Snake Necro. Now this will be a fucking weirdo match. Okay. Very nice move. I just gotta stay in mid range and try not to let him combo, because if he combos, he's gonna do giant stun meter to him. Go for it. Look at that! Look at that! What a weird combo. Punished! Oh my god, I punished you! Nice! Normal Urian can't do that because I had time and slow to Yuri and I could punish his hit string. He didn't he's like, oh shit, he could do that? Yeah. Wow, that was good stuff. That was a good fight. Freddie B. Cardi just are gifted us up to the master programmer. Congrats, master programmer. Thank you, Freddie B, for the support. And Street Fighter fan to me, $5.25. You're truly amazing. Have a good night, Phil. Thank you to Street Fighter fan. I appreciate that. All right. Oh, uh, Denjin Hadouken, huh? Yeah. I moved it to come out. Wow! I'm so delayed. This guy does not block low at all. I hit him a million times low. Are you ready? Go! No move. Oh my god! I can't get the combo. Wow, easy. I don't know. That guy stinks. Freddy Bicardi Cheers. So what do you think of this decade of game is going to become? AR, VR? Oh, I don't know. There will be a gimmick. There's always a gimmick. Every generation of gaming, there's a stupid ass gimmick. It never fucking fails. But I don't know what it's gonna be. Haha. <laughs> Akuma? 
Oh no! Oh! What the fuck? My phone threw his goddamn body! Whoa! I hit him from behind with an EX fireball! Wow! I can't counter hit when he when he oh, I should be able to punish all his whiffs. I can't punish anything. He's done. Oh man. Alright, Gorilla X Pimp Cheers said I love the vest. I'm gonna use Spider-Man vest and it's for Servace Supreme Co Versace Supreme Collab vest with fur, make it gangsta golden. What have I done? Alright guys, this is probably going to be the last match of the night at this point. We've gone late. I think it's time for the final match. A, a T-Hawk mirror match. Here we go. Thank you, Derek. Yeah, I can't believe I doubled the tips goal tonight either. Didn't look like we were going to hit it at all. So, pretty miraculous. That's what I did, damn. Oh my god, he caught me! He caught me from that distance. Wow. It's terrible. Nice move. Oh, it ticked me to death. Very nice. Good match. Over, apparently, original Hawk is better than uh, the new version of T Hawk because he has some better normals and stuff. So, all right, that's gonna be it. Thank you guys. I mean, I I really apologize. It took so long for us to get two hours of gameplay in because the lobbies were so bad tonight. But we had fun. It was a good match. It was good, good, good matches all around. Thank you, obviously, for the support. Um, here. Thank you for the support. Hope you enjoyed the new, the new vest. Uh, so now we're gonna have five vests to choose from every day. It's gonna be original beige, blue, platinum, slim gray, and dapper red. All right. We have five freaking vests. Derek says I look like Marty. See, Derek, I disagree. I think the vest is too red. The vest is more like Barry Burton from Resident Evil. I wanted a lighter color red or orangish, more orangish vest, and I couldn't get one. I ordered this and it ended up not being what it looked like online. But I hope you guys like it. Thank you very much for a very supportive day. I feel a little bit more positive now because earlier today I was feeling a little bummed out. I feel better now, so thank you guys for the support and thank you for kind of cheering me up tonight. I appreciate that, you know, with, with your kind words. Not only your support there, obviously, but your kind words. You guys are basically trying to cheer me up and say, don't worry about the haters and shit, and I agree with you. All right. So thank you very much. Until next week for more Street Fighter.